Hello everyone, welcome back. In this video session, we shall uh, we shall add a photo gallery. We shall add a photo gallery. You know, in this workshop, we are dealing with what we see as the basic, at least the basic. Okay, we are dealing with everything basic. That's what we are dealing in this workshop. Okay. Uh, I have things here already in the home my documents okay I don't have anything here so let's say I just add a photo gallery here when I click on my documents okay I have something in the math course labels and math lessons but my documents I don't have anything yet so let's say I add a photo gallery right here okay so I will click on gallery I will hold it and drag it here and it says upload images you know this is kind of like a gallery so I click on this uh, drag gallery photos here or upload gallery photos from your computer so now uh, one thing you should know about a gallery is that you want all pictures to be the same okay you want all the pictures to be the same so you probably you let's say you did a class project and you took pictures of the projects or uh, of your students with the parents consent you know for you to put the uh, your students pictures it should have parent consent it should have their parental consent okay uh it should have their parents consent i mean so let's say you have all these pictures you may need to kind of resize them. I have demonstrated how to resize videos. You may need to crop and resize them so that they are the same. Usually you might want to make it 150 by 150 pixels or 200 by 200 pixels. So, and photo galleries are, means that at least there are, you know, you have a bunch of the pictures. You have several of those pictures, not just one or two yeah okay uh you click on pictures well this is my own pictures this is my pictures anyway and let me kind of see if i have some pictures here i can uh, put maybe uh i know these are not the same pictures but let me just add them i mean these are not the same sizes of the pictures but let me just add them okay just for this uh, just for this workshop so I'm gonna add these pictures here and you can kind of add as many as you want to you know you can kind of add as many as you want to so I've added it it's gonna take some time to upload the file depending on your internet speed so it's kind of straightforward to add uh, pictures. It's, it's very straightforward to do that. Yeah. Remember, it is necessary that all the pictures are the same size. In this, my example, not all the pictures are the same size, but you know, you see, because they are all the pictures are not of the same size, it cuts them so that it will be of the same size. So you see, in this one, it didn't kind of appear well. Yeah, so it's better you do it yourself. In this one, it cut my, uh, it cut this, you know, the head, you know, my head. It it cut it. So it's good that you resize them first. Resize it first before you, you know, before you post it. Okay. And after this, uh, you just publish it. After this, you just publish it. Yeah. And of course, you come here to the website, you refresh it. You can either refresh or you click on that after it's published. And I mark documents, and those are the pictures you see. Those are the pictures. So, but you want, like I said, you want to kind of resize it first. Uh, you crop and resize it yourself before you post it okay 
all right that is it for adding a gallery for any page you want to you can add a gallery thank you so much for listening okay and please watch out for the other videos